Hey everybody, it's Ram from GameSpace130 and welcome back to my MLB 16 franchise playthrough with the New York Mets. Um, before I get started here, don't forget to click the like button to support my YouTube channel. If you guys like this video, um, it'll help circulate my video throughout the YouTube universe a lot more. Um, that way you can get a lot more views and I can get more content out there. And don't forget to click the subscribe button if you guys haven't subscribed already to get the latest video updates uh, whenever I upload something on YouTube. And then, last but not least, uh, please comment my video um, if you guys like it, if you guys think that I should do something to improve my video, or if you guys have any uh, suggestions on what games I should play, uh, leave that in the comments below. And let's get it started here. So, um, the last game I played is the sweep against the Cubs. We had a day off and went straight to Miami, where we went 10 to 3. With Zach Wheeler, uh, Steven Matz pitching, going for his 13th win. Uh, we had 17 hits. And we had Conforto hitting home runs, Cespedes with the paired home runs. Uh, Walker to the home run as well, as well as Granderson. And then we had Conforto driving in two, Cespedes driving in two, Walker with one, and Granderson, I believe, uh, also with an RBI. And then we move on to the next game. Uh, we won 11 and 2. Matt Harvey went for his 11th uh, win of the season. And. Let's look at what the line score here. We had Conforto, Cespedes, Duda, and Walker all hitting home runs. Uh, Reyes driving in one, Wright driving in a pair. Conforto driving in three, Cespedes driving in two, and New Walker driving in one, and then Matt Harvey driving in a run with a double. And then we had a stolen base for Jose Reyes. I take a look at the pitching here. Um, as I said, Matt Harvey drove in the 17th run of the season, going seven innings pitch, 14 strikeouts, one walk, and two earned runs. Uh, Jeremy Blevins and Montero came in for a mop-up roll. Um, and then to finish off the Marlins series, we won 4-2 um, with the pitch for us. With uh, Syndergaard going for a 17th win, uh, pitching 7 innings and giving up 2 runs with 10 strikeouts. Colon, Bastardo, Montero all had holds to combine for 1 inning. Familia came in for his 32nd save. Um, turns for hitting here, we had Granison with a triple, Duda with a home run, and then we had Wright, Duda, and Darno driving, driving in runs. Um, let's see here. And then we went back home to New York to start the series, uh, where we won 6-2, getting a 90th to win of the season already, making us 90-9. Um, gave up two home runs, one to Adam and one to Holiday. And then for the Mets, we had Granison hit a home run, Walker with two home runs and Darno with a home run. Um, so Granison drove in one, Walker two RBIs, and Darno with three RBIs. Um, actually, wait, let me see here. And let's see the end of this game. And then this game here uh, for July 26th, we won 3 0 um, just behind Duda's two run home run. And you want to put this is infield single driving Jose Reyes. Um, so we ended up getting, giving Wainwright his fourth loss of the season. And then Wheeler got his 16th win of the season, pitching eight innings, giving up six hits, and with 16 strikeouts. Uh, Familia came in the ninth inning with his 33rd save, uh, pitching one complete inning. So before I get started here, I did have a major trade that happened. Uh, what is this? Oh, it's a bunch of injuries here. Um, okay, anyway. So let's go to the completed uh, go to the trades here. I don't know if you guys can see it here. Let me scroll down to the top line. So I acquired Ichiro Suzuki uh, for Alejandro De Aza uh, probably a, a day ago. I haven't gotten a chance to play Ichiro yet. And yeah, I mean, they're both on the final year of the contract. Ichiro has been one of my favorite players. And he is close to 3,000 hits, so I would want him to get it for um, the Mets here. And I actually did call up Dilson Herrera and called on uh, Muno, so Danny Muno. So we're going to try to get him started onto the Mets lineup soon enough. And now, so we were going to go back to City Field and try to sweep the um, the Cardinals here with Steven Matz on the mound, getting trying for his 14th win of the season. Going against Michael Waka, who's going for his 14th win of the season as well. And let's check out the lineups here. Everyone's pretty well rested here. 
Uh, so lineups going to be Jose Reyes, David Wright, Michael Conforto, Ioannis Cespedes, Lucas Duda, Neil Walker, Curtis Granderson, and Travis Darno at the catcher spot. And then finally in the ninth spot is Steven Matz. All right, guys, I'll see you guys on the field. Okay, so here we are in beautiful City Field. Uh, as I said before, the Mets are trying to go for his 91st win, and the Cardinals try to get their 54th win of the season. Um, here we are. We have Steven Matz, uh, the pitcher for today, and Michael Carpenter, who's like 275 with 12 home runs and 35 RBIs. Jose Reyes, batting 289 with four home runs here. Probably going to be a double here, driving it deep into the left center field wall. And that is a first pitch double for Jose Reyes starting the game. Michael Conforto, the second batting uh, average leader in the majors. Second to Neil Walker, batting 339 here. Trying to drive in Jose Reyes. Uh, with 27 home runs, 51 RBIs, with a 627 slugging percentage. That's a base hit. Oh, what what happened there? He completely missed the ball. And Jose Reyes comes in to score, and then Michael Conforto has an RBI double. Duda drives it deep. And it's out of here. That is a two-run home run for Lucas Duda. That's his 43rd of the year. As the apple goes up and Duda continues to try around the bases. This man's bat is on fire carrying this offense in this game right now. Giving Tim Tuffle a high five for the 43rd time of the year. You gotta believe that's the Mets phrase. Going 436 feet, let's go to the replay. Down and in, Duda goes away. Right into the black area of City Field, Center Field. Boom, deep shot. There could be a double play. Getting okay, Holiday. And Peralta for a double play. Reyes to Walker to Duda. Duda drives it deep again. Is this a home run? No, it's going to be off the wall. Conforto goes home and Duda goes to second base. And that's a double for Lucas Duda driving another run. Neil Walker drives on deep, is just out of here. And he misses it. So it's another double for the Mets, and Duda goes home from second base. It's now 6 to nothing Mets. On 2 to Gray Chuck here in the ninth inning. Cardinals on their final strike. Got him swinging, ball game over. And that is a complete game shutout for Steven Matz. What a performance by the young lefty. And the Mets come to celebrate, and Mats gets the game ball. That's a little quick uh, line score here. Carlos with five hits, no runs. Mets with six runs, ten hits, and an error. Uh, top hitter for the Mets was Lucas Duda with his 42nd home run of the year, I believe, or 43rd. Um, and. Pitch, play of the game though is Steven Matz uh, who pitched nine innings five hits allowed with eight strikeouts uh, the Mets continue their winning streak and that's it I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of my MLB 16 playthrough with the New York Mets don't forget to click the like button uh, share this on Facebook Twitter or whatever uh, leave in the comments below and don't forget to click that like button and I'll see you guys next time.